When George Dunlap went to start the water for a shower last Thursday, he kept turning the faucet, but quickly realized that there was a problem. We weren't getting a real hot shower, and, that, and by turning it that far, we should have got real hot water. A day later, the water was still cold, so he thought... Maybe the water heater just went out completely. Dunlap went to the basement and found the pilot light had gone out. He tried to relight it, but didn't have any luck. Figured that maybe a thermocoupling went out. Nope, that wasn't the problem either. This is what he theorized. Those cicadas got down in there and, and they fried themselves, but they got where they uh, knocked the pilot light completely out. That's right. He found cicadas inside the water heater. I was, really wasn't surprised that the cicadas were there because, you know, I've seen them here in the basement, live ones and dead ones. And then I could hear them in the uh, furnace area. How do the bugs get into the basement? The point of entry seems to be that uncapped chimney right up there. Photographer Scott Wegener and I found dozens of them swarming around the opening at the top of the bricks. But Dunlap was philosophical about the bugs, since he says they'll be gone in a month. They don't bother me that much when you're working outside. You get used to them now. They bang into your head and you're getting your shirt and stuff like that. 